Uh, pretty much any issue or idea you care to name, the Irish have two competing ideas about it. And of course, it being Ireland, people would say, Aperture, you're both right. There are perennial debates about should we pay more tax for this or less tax for that. And nobody wants to pay more tax, but at the same time, everybody wants all the things that you have to pay tax for, but somehow they think they can magic it up out of the sky. So walk out the window and ask an Irish person, would you like to see a United Ireland? One word answer, they'd say yes. If you gave them more than one word, they'd say yes, but uh, I don't want to pay any more tax for it. I want them to be more like us. Uh, because they don't seem like us. But no one wants to admit that the de facto situation is that most people in the Republic actually don't want a United Ireland. Now, ostensibly, we are very friendly if you're an American tourist and you come here and you meet Irish people for the first time, they're very helpful, they, you know, they ask you questions about yourself. But if you move to next door to that person, suddenly they're not so friendly. There's a, a study done in the 1950s in, a, in an American college town and uh, a third of the population were American, a third were Irish and a third were Italians. There was a, a centre for the study of uh, alcoholism there. There was about a thousand inmates who were alcoholics. Um, hundreds of them were Irish, there was about 30 Italians. Uh, and they drank pretty much the same amount, except it was the way the Irish drank it, they, or the Italians drank it. The, the Italians might have a snifter at breakfast, which is not an uncommon thing in Europe, but they consumed it as food. The Irish saved it up for a Friday night and then drank themselves into oblivion. So we're using it as a kind of a, you know, it's, it's all too often used as a psychological crutch. Apart from the fact that just drinking too much isn't good for you anyway. I think it's a cultural problem that's been there for hundreds of years. This is, you know, when you hear people going, oh, when I was, you know, when I was a young fellow, I was a few pints and a bit of a set dance. That's all nonsense. People always drank too much in this country. I would, but, um, if I could fix one night, I would make logic. Um, a, a leaving cert subject and a, a mandatory leaving cert subject so that we would force our, our way to think that, you know, two and two doesn't make five, no matter how you might want it to make five because you're an emotional being, I would do that.